Hey, Pirates. Good morning, Pirates. Today is February 9th, 2024. I'm Ariana. I'm Nate. I'm Trace. And this is your Pirate TV. Karen Martinez Vega. I am Evan Dunbar. I'm Michael Paddock. Ariana Hudson. I'm Karen Martinez Vega here, and these are things you need to know. Today, the NGR OTC will be taking a field trip to the Jacksonville Naval Air Base all day. Key Club Valentine's Day grams will be sold in the cafe during all lunches. The girls' basketball district finals game will be played at 7 p.m. Tomorrow, the wrestling Winter Haven tournament will be taking place at Ekoe High all day. And finally, the boys' basketball district finals game will be taking place at Mariner at 7 p.m. I'm Karen Martinez Vega with Pirate TV. Hey Pirates, I'm Ariana. And I'm Sabrina. And we're here with an announcement from Key Club. Key Club will be selling Valentine candy grams for $2. During all the lunches from February 5th through February 12th. Make sure to get, you, get yourself some candy grams Mwah. this holiday season. Mwah. Hello Pirates. I'm Karen Martinez Vega here with some details about the upcoming class social for sophomores and juniors. There will be a Valentine's Day class social that will be taking place on Wednesday, February 14th. Attendees will take part in fun activities such as cookie decorating, making Valentine's Day cards, and more, as well as receive a goodie bag. If you want to participate, you must have paid your class dues. If you have any questions or would like to know more details about the event, Sophomores can see Ms. Barone in B203 and juniors can see Ms. Parrott in B109. Students will be released via the intercom. I'm Karen Martinez Vega with Pirate TV. Hey Pirates, there, will be a, there is a silent book club that started on January 7th. This book club is every Sunday, 2.30 to 4.30. If you're interested, it will be held at the rec Recreational Center in Port Charlotte at 1120 Centennial Boulevard. So, the main event of the NFL, the moment that we have all been waiting for. Super Bowl! Super Bowl 58 between the Kansas City Chiefs versus the San Francisco 49ers. The rematch. Nathan, what do you have? I got Kansas City. I don't want to see Brock Purdy throw 30 check downs in the Super Bowl. I just don't. Mr. E. Velvet is not winning. Patrick Holmes, the dynasty of the Kansas City Chiefs is on the rise. They're going to win. They Travis Kelsey, gotta go crazy. Taylor Swift is just gonna get camera shots be tied in the game. Um, I'm not liking the energy coming from Nathan about the Chiefs. Look, I got the Chiefs too. I think that the Chiefs are gonna win, you know, just, I mean, it's kind of funny. You already know what's gonna happen. Um, no, matter, no matter how much I want to see the 49ers win, they're not gonna win, unfortunately. It's gonna be the Chiefs win. But I do want to talk about the playoff games. Last time I said that the 49ers were going to win, and they did, but while I was watching it, I changed my opinion. I wanted the Lions to win, but... Oh, so are you oh, one so wait, now? One no. Yes. I, I, on the show, I said the 49ers, and they did win, but while, after the show, I was mm, Lions, okay, but... So. 
I, I know my, dude, that's like the same thing now. I want the 49ers to win, but I'm still saying the Chiefs. Yeah, I got the Chiefs as well. Um, I got you know, Patrick Mahomes. This is the Chiefs' fourth time in five yeah, years five. Uh, being in the Super Bowl. Uh, so I think Patrick, he's going to go out. He's going to go all out. Travis, since Taylor Swift is probably going to be there, he's going to go for like 10 receptions. And uh, yeah, like Nathan said, I was going to check all these guys. Let's hope so, this is the last time in yeah. the next five years. <laughs> yeah, let's Probably go. not. All right. Next year's going to be Lions, Bills. Lions, Bills next year. So Lions, Lions, Lions and Bills. Lions and Bills. What's going on, Pirates? It's time for the weather. And, you know, we've got a long show today. So, this is going to be a short weather, not looking at the overall weather, just what's going on in Port Charlotte. So, it's going to be a warmer week this week, definitely warmer uh, than, you know, the current week. But, um, yeah, it's going to cool off a little bit at the end, and it's going to be very cloudy literally every day except Wednesday. And you can probably expect a little bit of rain, uh, and it's probably going to be at the most inconvenient time that it could be. So expect that. It's going to be another week of colder mornings and warmer afternoons. Um, so, <clears throat> yeah, you might want to wear a hoodie, a long sleeve, and then um, plan on taking it off later in the day. So, yeah, that's, I'm Evan Dunbar, and that's your weather recap coming up next week. going on pirates welcome back to season two episode two of walk the plank host by yours truly casey white today we're having a little game show called are you smarter than evan Nunbar? speaking of where is this man oh. evan Nunbar, guys definitely didn't see him down there how's it going nothing uh it's going great it's good to hear so today we're going to be playing a little game are you smarter than evan Nunbar? you might watch the show are you smarter than a fifth grader it's gonna be sort of like that. We got a little spinning wheel right here where I'm gonna spin and the contestants are going to, well, answer the questions. If they get it right, they get a point. If they get it wrong, they don't. And during, they can ask Evan Dunbar for a hint, but he doesn't have to decide if it's a good hint or a bad hint. It could be the wrong answer for all they know. They have to decide that with their own mind. And without further ado, contestants, why don't you uh, introduce yourselves? Oh. Starting with you, Nico. Hello, my name is Nicholas Bruschi. I'm Kaylee Crane. I'm Nick Alexander. And thank you guys for joining us today. You want to say something? I would. I would like to have this known that these answers are from a fifth grade test that I took. These, so, and um, yeah, it's been about seven years since fifth grade, but I think that was my academic peak. So you can expect these answers to be uh, pretty rigorous. It's a nice word right there, rigorous. I like that. Fifth grade, fifth grade, I don't even know that. I didn't pass, actually. All right, so without further ado, let's get started. So let's see, what's our first question gonna be here today? Spin, 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 spin. All right, question is, how many inches are in a yard? You guys have 10 seconds to count this. I mean, count. Well, you gotta count. Three, Two, one, markers down. All right, without, starting with Nico, let's show our papers. What do you got over there? 12 inches, 12 inches is actually a foot, not a yard. Kaylee, 48 inches, wonder where you got that from. And Nick, Casey smells. Okay, well, we don't have to show Nick anymore, guys. We can just completely, and be obsolete. Yeah, so. We went 0 for 3 on this one, guys. The correct answer was 36, 12 inches per foot, yard, 3 foot. Simple math. Come on, get it together. Spin, 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 spin that wheel. <laughs> oh, if you guys don't get this, come on. Miss Dodge is going to be mad. What gas do humans need in order to live? All right, guys, let's start out. We got oxygen. Oxygen. And oxygen! Look at that. Three, four, three. Good job, guys. Look at that. You actually did that. Thank you. 
No mental math. Spin, spin, and... What is the hardest mineral? Do you know what the hardest mineral is on there? Um, of course I do, Tracy White. I actually got all these right. That's why they're on the uh, Mr. Dunbar. Oh, Mr. Oh. Dunbar. I wanna, oh, I wanna, pause I the timer. Him. I do want to ask our fifth grader over here. Of course, it's Evan Dunbar. A hint. A hint? Yes, sir. Um, they, they come in carrots and they are very expensive. It's a great hint. Come in carrots and are very expensive. Blue question now. The ancient Egyptian empire was based on what continent? You know, I am a big geography... Hold on. I am a big geography uh, buff. I won the geography bee in middle school, so... So this was, this, you know, this was light work for a guy like me. I'll have you know. Three, two... Go ahead, uh, give it up for first. First place. Class, give a round of applause. It's going to be Nico, obviously. So, yeah, maybe, maybe it's for the not wearing glasses. With our winners come losers. So if you know from past Walk the Plank episodes, our tradition is losers get pie in the face. Bye. Three, two, one, squish. Oh, oh. <laughs> You got all the sun right there, man. Get away from me. <laughs> you have protection on her eyes. She cheated. No, get away. Oh, I can't see it. She all. cheated. No. That's happened way too many times in this show. I'm not getting pranked again. <laughs> Are you guys okay? She can't see anything, and you're breathing it in. You can't see anything either. Yeah. All right, well, I'm going to have to ask you guys to open your eyes. You can't okay. wipe them off. Three. Thank you for joining us on Walk the Plank. Look at that, guys. Um, I completely forgot to get napkin. That's it for today's broadcast. See you next time for some more Pirate TV. The best news on the seven seas. All right. There you go. That was good. Yeah.